Intense cross-border exchanges are ongoing along the Lebanese border with Hezbollah, mainly on the receiving side. This as the IDF completed a stage of preparations in case the conflict expands into full-blown war. More from ILTV's Steve Leibowitz. IDF fighter jets carried out strikes on a military compound belonging to Hezbollah's elite Radwan force in Khaib in southern Lebanon. The compound includes seven buildings used by the terror group. The IDF also struck a Hezbollah command center in Tura. Elsewhere, an elite Hezbollah commander was killed along with two others in an Israeli strike on the village of al Sultania in southern Lebanon. Earlier, a barrage of rockets was fired from Lebanon at the Golan Heights and Manara area. The potential for hostilities to escalate into war continues. Another phase of the IDF Northern Command's readiness for war was completed, centering on operational emergency storages for a broad mobilization of reservists and regular troops, if and when required. This will enable the forces to arrive at the front line in a short period of time for defensive and offensive missions. Meanwhile, the frustration of northern residents out of home for six months continues. Tens of thousands of northerners remain evacuated, sitting by helplessly as their communities sustain damages from Hezbollah rocket and mortar fire. This man from Shlomi summed up the feelings of many. <laughs> שאנחנו מאוד אוהבים להיות בו ולארח בו. ובמצב הקיים עכשיו, זה התחיל מאיזשהו מסע של ציפייה, של טוב, אוקיי, ייקח שבוע, שבועיים, שלושה, יסתיים, בינתיים זה מתגלגל ומתגלגל. לא רואים את הסוף. לא ברור גם מה הסוף.